Some people say that the paradoxes of quantum mechanics can only be explained if it is linked to the consciousness of the observer in the so-called observer effect. But this video will put forward the opposite idea that a deeper understanding of the physics of quantum mechanics will give us a greater understanding of how consciousness works. We can see in the two-slit experiment that it is only when a detector is turned on that the interference pattern collapses. In other words, only when light comes into physical contact with something does it collapse into photons or particles. When a detector is turned off, the interference pattern will reform. It is the conscious idea that leads to the physical action, but it is the action itself that collapses the wave function of quantum physics. This is because the quantum wave particle function is continuously collapsing, reforming, creating new photon particles in space-time that is part of the continuum of time itself, or arrow of time. In this theory, we form our own quantum particles. The atoms bond together and react with the wave particle duality of light in unison, forming their own future space-time geometry. We see and feel this as the forward passage of time itself. This speculative diagram highlights the profound symmetry between matter and antimatter, positive and negative charge. It is the inward absorption and outward emission of light, or electromagnetic radiation, that forms matter-antimatter annihilation, forming positive and negative charge that in turn forms electromagnetic fields. Because of this process we have a potential infinity of future possibilities at every point in space and at every moment in time that can spiral out forming its own space-time geometry. If the laws of physics are universal then this process formed by the wave particle duality of light must be happening everywhere and must affect everything even consciousness itself. Despite rapid progress much about how the brain works remains a mystery but what we do know is that our brains work by electrical impulses forming chemical changes. This electrical activity also forms electromagnetic fields. If these electrical impulses that cause chemical changes are formed by photons, then consciousness is formed by the physics of quantum mechanics. Therefore our thought processes could be seen as the most advanced part of a universal process, and our hopes and dreams could be forming their own future space-time geometry.